the book of Psalm chapter 55 verse 6 I said Argari Oh that I had wings like a dove Ana ana kenale di pofa ja kaliba For then would I flee away Nenka fofela go sele and be addressed Ebe kenale bo iketla May the Lord bless the reading of Psalms. This is David, a man after God's heart. Ona ke ta fita manna ka go go mara go gapelo a modimo. He said all that I had wings like a dove I would fly away and be at rest. A reng ka ne ke khona neng ka iphofela seleba ke sengela boiketlo. Clearly when he was pinning this down David was under a horrendous turmoils boisterous winds One a tsegeditse seemo sa diemo He was under a drastic chaos One a susumetswe ke botlhoko David was under a serious emotional pressure David was highly displaced David was no longer elastic David was unable to bear the pain upon his shoulder all hell broke loose the air was no longer conducive it was bad it was hard it was tough for david until he reached a point to say all that i had wings like a dove i would fly away and be at rest are you hearing me are you hearing me the times in life the corners you hit in life the junctions you assume in life the passages and ways you encounter in life and they don't serve you as per your expectation don't yield unto you as you wish rather they reward you with the opposite of expectation and the funny part is that you are still anointed and you call confidently yourself a child of God but when you look around your circumference it is not it is supposed to appear and you wish you had wings like a dove and fly away you feel like taking off in order to have yourself rest from such turmoil. The Lord wants to speak to you this afternoon. O ye that are burdened. O ye that are weary. O ye that are crawling on their knees. O ye that are saying my ways are grown dark. O ye that are saying I no longer have direction. O ye that are saying I'm in dilemma and I'm confused. All things appear uncertain. Oh, ye that are saying there is a heavy burden upon my shoulder and I can't bear it anymore. The Lord wants to minister to such a candidate that very person who is saying, My heart is weary, my soul is poisoned, I feel contaminated, I feel mixed 
stop. I, I, I feel all that a person can never imagine of a thorn. You are the very person the Lord wants to minister to in this very psalm session. Am I speaking to you? Am I speaking to you? Am I speaking to you? He wants to minister to that very person who is saying, Lord, I know you are good, but the fact of the matter is I'm weary. Lord, I know you are good, but I'm fearful in this corner. Death has overwhelmed my soul. I know you are good, but there is only one resort. There is only one alternative that I want to apprehend. I feel like I want rest. Because such as the things that are happening to me in this world, I can't take it anymore. I feel burdened. I feel cast down. I feel out and I feel worn down. There is no joy in my spirit. There is no excitement in my spirit. I don't get a reason of me breathing again. It's like an, I can breathe for the last time. And never breathe again. It's like I can, can sleep one more time. And never wake up. It's like I can disappear. It's like my spirit can part away with my flesh. My spirit. Spirit doesn't feel How we could like live. abiding in my flesh. It's tired, it's tiresome. It's like I can develop wings like that of a dove and fly away. Find a resting place whenever a dove is exposed to danger. It will lie upon the wing. To carry it to the nest. Rely upon the wing. To carry it to the middle, the highest, the height of the of the trees. Whenever they're exposed to danger, they depend on their wing to fly away. But oh God of heaven, I'm circumference. I'm surrounded. I'm in the vicinity and the damage. I'm locked within the parameters and the borders of issues that I can't bear anymore. I need some rest. Help me now. Or I don't have help anymore. David said that cast the burden unto the Lord for he shall sustain you and he will never allow the righteous to be moved. In this very moment in time, there is that man, that woman. The Lord had sent me strongly. That he said to you, He is your refuge. He is your refuge. He is your strong tower. He is your rock and your shield. He is still your God. Are you hearing me? He's still your God. If you don't know where to cry to, the Lord said, My ears to you, they are not heavy. That I may not hear such as you call me. Who do you? I want to encourage you. Declare a momentum in your spirit. Rise up again. Rise up again. Shake yourself again. Pray again. Hope again. Believe again. Believe again. Believe again. Some try. 
fast in horses. Some men chariot. But we shall trust in the name of the Lord. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run to it. And they are saved. David said, I ought to this age. I've never seen the righteous forsaken. He said again, I'll never leave you. No forsake you. The Lord is with you. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. I want to speak to you. There is a way in the wilderness. There is a water brook in the wilderness. It's not the end thereof. Lift up your hands. His ears are open. His heart is attracted you speak to him now in this moment in time speak to him child of god you cry in the midst of the night mountains may fall the seas may rise but your love never fails Elande karatule Zaka palabrata Leko pranta zili kabawa Kandalika shatali Obratali kata You are the God who never forsakes Kalabaratala As a bird From the snare of a fowl our souls Have escaped Yes our souls have escaped. A cabra de la tala, Pekatari landa satala. Oh, Jesus.